and does it, you know, in a different agent, basically. Uh, while Sick able to pick up the raids instead as he looking to try to defend against uh, and be looking to attack into short A pretty heavy handedly. Uh, Zoms has stayed behind this poison cloud. Even exchange coming through, but Mummy is able to find two. Zoms will be denied by the wall. Mummy going to use that as an opportunity to plant. But the retake. Try to get there quickly. Dapper gets caught out. So now it is just down to Zoms trying to clear some space as Shazam works from the flank. Mummy wants to challenge, but is only able to push back Zoms. Not able to successfully get the elimination. Shazam on the way in. It's a read that crashes is nearby. Good shock dart comes out. Recon bolt also has to be destroyed, and it will be. So now it's down to Sentinels. Can you get a little bit further forward as Envy tries to play this from the defensive side of the site? And no one's peeking. I mean, Envy are happy to let the time kind of fade away. Mummy finds his third. Zom's making the play forward. Denied by Crashies, and Envy win the pistol. Yeah, very crafty round, right? You're just coming in, which plays a little bit later on. In fact, it's right after this, basically. After, yeah. Now, yeah. maybe a bit of a break. No break there for Shazam, trying to get forward with his own recon dart. Pen's trying to follow up, and boy, does he. Finds the first, dismisses away. Shock dart will not connect. Second one will. Still an opportunity for Ten to try to battle back. Not going to find elimination. And meanwhile, over towards A, Sick has also been dealt with. So Envy's offense with numbers looking to approach upon this B-set. Ken's now getting guarded as well. Forced to go into the back halls. Could get spammed at that wall. That is a spammable option, but not going to come into play, really. Meanwhile, Orb gets deep into back halls, giving Envy further control of the site. They've also still have a player, I believe, playing... Yeah, indeed, it is going to be Mar playing over here towards a good position. Oh, Does get win. shut down by Dapper, though. It's a three-on-three three to still keep this retake alive, but again, inferior firepower, and since it's low on health. But Dapper does find an SMG. They can hit this from multiple angles simultaneously. You feel like Dapper should be the second player forward, knowing that his weapon is going to be the difference maker. Here comes the play. FNS for one, gets the second. Now up top, Dapper tries to do the same, but gets cut short. Mummy able to find the trade, and Envy takes the second round. And Responsible for... Watching the shower side hit, which would just be marred for Envy. Zoms, does he get scouted out by the drone? Not tagged, but doesn't make a difference. Mummy able to find one. Exchange will be there. Marv had a free angle, but misses the opportunity. And Dapper, who gets up from the heaven, finds the kill. So Sentinel's defense holds on strongly yeah, the initial I think, attempt. I think Ten's just got to dismiss in time to get away from Marv there to get into that corner and stay safe. And that's going to prompt Envy left. to try to make this double back over to B side with their three remaining players. They do get the entry thanks to Finesse. It gets it back into a three on three. He's got Viper Spit available to get the spike planted and help hold off this retake spike from Sentinels. should be coming any second now. Ah, but Dapper around through elbow. Taken out. 3v2 situation favoring Envy in a major way. Shock Dart's trying to clear. There's some thrown in response. Finesse is holding in a corner. And Sentinels, how do you get through this? Even the Blast Pack's becoming a bit of a nuisance. Recon Dart comes out, instantly denied. Tends the first one forward, trying to clear wherever he possibly can. Finds the first, that's FNS down. Now as the hit fades away, Victor gonna be tested. Finds the first, Tense on the regen, not gonna find the second elimination. As Victor gets the double and Envy stay flawless through three. Yeah, really nicely. Their attack has always been so good on this map. Yeah. Oh, Crashies baits out the Alphador, but Tens, if you were to tell him, hey, Tens, this is not a fight that anyone should ever win, he would say, challenge accepted. As he takes a secondary peek and turns it into a 4v4. Decent news for the Sentinel's defense. Zom's in the corner, but it's a stinger. Not quite able to capitalize. Tens eventually falls, but Shazam responds. Opportunity for more is the double peek from these sheriffs from Shazam and Dapper continue to find value. And then we have to, Smart. once again, turn tail and run. Yeah, smartly done, though. They had the Phantoms, they had the plant. They have plenty of health to spare. Phantoms being picked up, though, by Dapper and Shazam, and they have armor, too, so this makes things interesting. Especially since Dapper has a Viper Spit to help this retake along, perhaps. Shazam with the Owl Drone. Recon Bolt surely to follow. Dapper going to clear some space, try to block off the entry with the Poison Cloud, and actually will commit the Viper Spit. Mummy wants to take this early, finds the first. Shazam down low, needs to respond in a dicey situation. Not going to be able to find one, let alone even a chance at the second. And I Envy feel like... Lies, if not significant success. Mm. Res available for Mummy, by the way, so that can certainly help things along here. Hunter Shuri comes out, certainly going to get some hits here. That's Mummy gone. Plus one more. And, and no res. Can't res yourself, bud. <laughs> Gets a tag as well through the middle of the map, so Envy hit down to... Some pretty cool critical HPs already. Like you mentioned, Mummy being down is not just no resurrection. It's no self-sustain coming out either for either FNS or Victor. Right. 
So Sentinels definitely have a nice little edge here to kick off this round. They have Empress available too if they so feel they need it. They had the double stars on short A, so any type of pivot from Envy would be stalled out by that. But they still do want to come into B. Six starting to kind of feel that pressure. We'll start to back off into safety here at elbow position. Just Shazam will be there for support. Main shells over the top as well. Shazam trying to get a crossfire. Responds beautifully to Victor over on top of Hookah. Looking for more than that. Crash is able to find one before being traded. But Sick again really cannot continue to contest this. Needs help and Dapper's there for the assistance. Finds the first. Marv though still responds. Knows that he's still got Sick caught in elbow. Part of me, Ten's caught in elbow. No, it's Sick. Part of me. I'm all over the place. We'll figure it out. 1v3. Marv stuck. No spike. And Tens is on the long flank from behind. This is going to be difficult for Marv to get out of. Yeah. Don't see it happening with this little time left. Getting swarmed and getting overwhelmed. So finally, Sentinel's able to get on the board. There's two uh, SMGs. Right here. Yeah, it looks like an A burst with maybe a Heaven Teleport here from Marv is in the cards. To run. Oh, that was risky. Crashy's trying to open up space. He does tag up some damage, but First Blood has been confirmed from Sentinels. And beyond that, there's really not an opportunity to fully clear out showers unless more utility from Crashy's comes out. He did use a shock dart. There's the second, and Tens eventually will fall to it. So neutralize in the First Blood. We go 4v4. No commitment just yet, though, from this fight. And they're going to get the res on Victor as well to really add to things here. Uh oh Sick, Oh, I thought that was going to land and be just devastating, but it happens to be just a bit wide. And so now... Envy are going to enjoy a 5-on-4 advantage. They're pivoting back to B-side. It had no presence there, though, so they have to be careful clearing out these corners, making sure that no one aggresses. Drone comes out just in time to spot this. And so now, obviously, Sentinels can make the proper rotations. Three members defensively onto the site. And you moving quickly. Not a lot of time here. Sick catches one with a spray down. Blast with a headshot onto a second plus the third. A little more traditionally done. And the spike is down. Sick creating some space as Shazam and Zoms watches back. And Sentinels win two in a row. Recover rifle, but... Right. I agree. Risky here from Sick, but Zoms here to assist. Yep, first blood again. Well designed bait and switch kind of play. Plus you get the orb. FNS trying to sneak through and oh, Ooh, I'm liking this. Yeah, Viper v Viper action. Dapper coming across. Is there maybe some insinuation that they know <gasps> might not make a difference because Marv finds a kill through Hookah. That's going to pull Dapper back towards B. And now really it's just down to the timing that FNS can find. Do you try to play for the defensive rotations or you try to sneak around the back? Looks like he wants to come around the back. Shazam, not going to expect this. There's the first, wants the second, not going to quite get it. Showstopper now being called, Dapper canceled out. And it's just down to the last two Sentinels defenders coming from spawn. Oh my goodness. And now the wall goes out on the back halls as well. They hear both players spamming that wall, so they know both players are coming from back halls. Victor's still concerned there might be a player flank. Up 2v4 here with this wall in the way. Slow orb also to come through. Sick. We're on the back. Needs to find two here. Not even gonna get the first. Bard recovering the Phantom. Makes good use of it. And now it's just down to Zombs. 1v4 Thrifty looking great for Envy at the moment. Oh yeah, for sure. Such a great use. I mean, that Viper wall has been there every single round. Again, when yeah. you're playing double controller, it's risk-free to just basically keep placing this Viper wall at A-side because even if you want to go B in a round, you can use the omen smokes and so it's no problem and so it conditions your opponent to kind of expect certain things based on much closer to his hunter steering i'll drone to follow informational tools for envy early being spent and again the same wall that's been positioned this time sick is playing top side of the truck does see one over the top of the toxic screen zom's good for another and combining for two of the sentinels defense plus also the early teleport play from shazam if he's even needed might not be sick has found three and now it's just down to fns no chance. Pretty good at the game, huh? Oh, man. Not a bad player, you know? Say Speedway, you don't know when they're going to grab well you and ruin your life. Oh, boy. Bomb's close. Oh, the showstopper in combination finds two. Sick will grab a third as well before being tritted out by Crashies. And Zom's likely going to deny, but ooh, Marv slips through at the exact right time from Showers to find one more elimination. Allows Crashies a chance to grab a Phantom, but will not be able to 
really finessed the Sentinel's defense. And Luka. Drone's gonna lead the way here for Envy. But again, Sentinel's has a good defense in place. They really do. Aldrin gets denied. Paint Shells finds value. Oh, even beyond that, you're looking at Shazam, who's trying to hold off this play with the Hunter's Fury. We'll find one. That'll keep things interesting on the site, but largely because of the eliminations off the paint shells, plus one more. Envy have taken the site, but Sentinels don't want to give it away so easily. Moving very quickly back on in. So the Viper's Pit will deny, and everyone will have to reset, wait for a bit of a regen before they can go. Oh, Marv coming into back halls is going to add to this power of Envy site control, and he's not done yet. Finds yet another. Zom slips into the hookah position but he is all alone and that viper spit is ever dangerous yeah i mean tip your hat to victor though for right? sure what a double kill especially to be able to basically 180 the guy under window after his paint shell delivers the first blow you figure that that's what makes that viper spit a lot more vulnerable i also have a big push coming in from tens this is a big flank potential here on sick, holding off showers. Good for one in a second. Paranoid. Paint shells are trying to create some space. He will be overwhelmed eventually, but here comes the flank from behind. Mummy does clear off the Viper's Pit, but that actually may assist Tense more than anything else because he'll have a free clean line of sight. And now all of a sudden, Envy feel a bit trapped on this B point. They're trying to exit, and Marv's going to get caught. Last one's down to Crashies. He was tagged up to half HP by a shock dart. Tense finishes things off. We go into round 12. But again, when you have both these teams being 60% successful on both sides of the map, keeping the half equal like this, again, makes you feel like this will be a close game when it's all said and done. Oh, my goodness. Okay, sick. Why don't you calm down there, buddy? Just confidence. Reeks yes. of it. Not going to get more than that, though. Resurrection will come through. Hunter Fury trying to respond. Dapper on the quick flank. No problem. Zoms also has an angle. Find one more beyond this, oh, but the trades what? are just back and forth. All this action happening right outside A mid. Tens into the Empress. Defensively, will have an angle at this. Avoids the shock dart. Crashes, of course, knows he's nearby, but it's not going to make much of a difference. The dismiss comes through. Tens will reposition, and it's down to a victor 1v2. Does have the showstopper. Knows that Tens is holding the left. Finds the first. Does he expect the second showstopper on the mix? But Shazam <gasps> finds the elimination first, and will finish... Even when they lost to Gen G, they had eight attack rounds. Yeah, I was, I was about to say, versus Gen G, there was a big display there, and okay. While Paranoid spamming through, but FNS! Frenzy in hand finds the first. Oh, he doesn't know which way to look. Runs out of ammunition, uh -oh. but it's still uh -oh. alive. Gets the reload off. Ow. He's going to have another chance at Shazam, but it's only a small chance. And you're going to reinforce <laughs> this defensively. Ten's watching the cross out of U-Haul. Recon Dart will reveal some area, but Envy are very apprehensive to keep, and rightfully so. Wow. Tense. Like, I won't even dismiss, but I'm going to linger around here and get another one. No chance. Think, think, I mean, if he would have got that one, too, then. then. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Crash, for saving the internet. But uh, Shazam will finish the job, and Sentinels will take the 7-6 lead. Already a match for the good as well. Again, winner this He's just checking to see. But how about the free take for Sentinels? I mean, they have to be sitting here saying, uh, hello? Ten, watching the cross. There's one. He'll have a chance for more. Doesn't want it. This backs away, knowing that his threat could be coming in very quickly. Now he'll hold his angle. Spamming things down. More damage. No eliminations. More to come. Gets the reload. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right. Well, recovering a rifle, or SMG, I should say, are envy, but this is, of course, very much so well read. Spike has been planted, and Sentinels are just going to entrap envy behind this play. Yeah, they've taken so much damage, even if they did take tens down, that retaking is gonna be tough. They're so vulnerable, and yeah, sitting down, mopping up the floors with the remains. Sick doing the standard boom bot lineup for a little bit of hookah control. Wall being put in the showers early, but quickly contested. Victor trying to hold hookah position up front. Oh my. Oh boy. Tough battle to lose. Yeah. Marv still feeling frisky. Able to find one. Dangerous peak, but he knows that Sick could be rotating over through Hookah. And now all of a sudden, Marv has actually gained some significant control. Crashes is trying to follow oh, yeah, up by big. clearing out Spices. But still, the kill's on site itself. Tens won the initial no. gunfight off screen through Shower. Clears up some space for but a the, couple of Sentinel members to get on site. But the spike isn't the here. The problem is, yeah, the spike's not there. And the problem is, can it get safely there? Yeah. Because Marv is here. Oh, my God. Six in so much trouble, and he goes down. And actually, now this gets really scary for Sentinels. 
Aw, oh, but Marv doesn't take down the recon bolt. Has to repay the paranoia. Finds one. Three in the back pocket of Marv this round. Shazam oh, still not able to recover. Either. Yeah. Oh, boy. Have they seen him? Left. Oh, you get some information here. Takes the peak, finds the first, but crashes. Woo! Would have capitalized that guy a little bit too close for comfort. Not, not a bad try, Shazam. Not a bad try. Yeah, I think he actually purchased. He mentioned the two ARs. I'm pretty sure he purchased last round. What? What? I don't think the recon bolt revealed that play. I think he no. just hits one through the smoke. Not at all. Oh my. If you're a Marv, I'm sorry, buddy. You didn't deserve for that. Uh oh. I'm just gonna rotate over. Hands opportunity. Not gonna happen. Shazam there to help find a couple of exchanges. Finesse stays alive through this gravity while trying to pull him out. Shazam down to just 20 HP. But Dapper's behind it. They've isolated. They know that he's here. Yeah, they baited it perfectly. Finesse has no clue. And the spike goes down. So 2v4, Judge and a Phantom for Envy on this retake attempt. Sick playing very far forward. It's going to be responsible for the link. One enemy remaining. Catches Victor. And then Dapper finishes things off. Sentinels. Clean and great isolation through shower. Don't expect the buzz cut to happen like that before the recon even blooms. Okay, Victor. Tries to Sign catch the timing off of the boom bot play, but misses it. I mean, that's a, I mean, that's a great first blood coming out for Sentinels. Barrier orb coming down for Mummy. Sick in the corner. Does he actually check Crashies? Does not. So big first elimination here for Crashies. Find this up to a 4-4. Four -four. Low on health, though. And Sentinels make sure that he can't collect that weapon. Yeah, they shuffle it backwards. That's a really good thought there from Dapper. They have a four on four, and they've made sure that no weapon reader has really passed over. They still have presence over on short side, thanks to Shazam's positioning here. He's keeping presence and keeping them interested. Meanwhile, they're coming into a now an empty B bomb side because Envy are forced to gamble. They had to lower firepower. They have to bite on this pressure Shazam has applied. They have to respect it. And that means that now they have to, got to play a retake on B with, again, this limited firepower. Now, they do have a Viper Spit. They do have a Hunter's Fury. They could maybe try to throw something cool in there, but you imagine they're going to save that next round. Oh, look at the post plan from Sentinels. You got Shazam watching the initial cross out of Spice. Tens, of course, in Hookah. Knows that Marv's on the corner. Although Mommy does win one gunfight. So Shazam falls. Plank becomes a bit more vulnerable. We're not going to know what's yeah. coming through screens either. This is still doable. Saz is a good position, though, as well to watch Finesse come through alongside. Yep, that's big. Crash is also false. Leaves things just to Mummy. And not going to be able to get a Sheriff shot off. Tens for three in the round, and Sentinels go up 10 7. Yeah, big round comes yesterday. Oh, I was about to say, Mummy, nearly an opportunity to find Sick with this slow orb placed, but could not quite recover initially. Sick, very quickly moving through. Showstopper, not going to be needed as Tens finds the kill in a crash. He's no problem. Shazam also efforted in the Hunter's Fury, and this Viper's Pit that was spent through mid is not going to have any significance defensively for Envy. No, I've never seen someone more screwed than Crashies in that round. For real. He was darted, getting hit by a Hunter's Fury, and getting jumped on by a Showstopper all at the same time. Like, what, what is that guy supposed to do at that point? And oh my goodness, Sentinels are just not letting up. Marv is going to have to watch this round come to a very yes. anti I, I want to see. <laughs> I want to see that from Crashies' perspective, because I just feel like his screen must have been full of LEDs. Just all the RGBs were on his screen. Just... No way he could really handle that. Just such a big opening pick from Sick, and they were so quick to capitalize from that point forward. What are we watching here? I don't know. Just having a little, little moment, <laughs> little bro moment. There Man. it is. Sentinels for eleven. One Phantom save thanks to Marv, but buying around it's going to be tough, and, and they kind of have to. You don't want to get Sentinels a free map and series point. Not bad at all. Yeah, they're giving up Optagon, they're doubling up on Hookah, and again, they avoided at least a really big loss there. Marv also being able to catch a kill over towards short, so this is actually looking pretty solid for Envy. They still have a nice little crossfire here on Hookah position. Dapper could very well run into it and come into a lot of trouble. Yeah, they have to give up Hookah and Long B because of that, but they're calculating that. They already have a yeah. man advantage, and again, they're going to maintain Hookah control most likely. Difficult fight here for Crash, though, with an SMG, or is it? Catches sick off guard. 
Also, the information, the spike is down, so here come the defenders very quickly on the rotation for Envy. Dapper, mid-map, nice response to Mummy. Also, again, knows that Crashes is nearby. Snakebite will push him back. Also, Rings no Victor on the flank, are you kidding? Tens in the dark no. cover. Oh, it's all going right for Sentinel. Spike now playing, and Crashy's trying to contest early, but cannot <gasps> line things up. It all falls down to Finesse. How does it so rapidly spiral down the oh. drain for Envy there? They did everything right. They maintained Hookah. They got the opening pick. They crushed the initial player out of Octagon. They had the recon on the site. Everything's going their way. And then they kind of get forced to push out of Hookah into Midyard, and they get crushed. And then they get owned on the site as well. 10 having 28 HP to spare in the midst of all of it. I, I just can't believe that that turned so quick. It, it felt like everything was setting up for Envy to win. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, my. That's a tough that one is... to swallow. Oh, yeah. Just, you feel it all the way down. Yeah. Got to eat an extra bite of bread to make sure final chance to get back up to play X set in the grand finals tomorrow. Oh, boy. It's just shower control has been sentinels all day long. They might get into showers, but then Tens is just like, well, <laughs> yeah, welcome to showers. Empress now earned. Shock Dirt to clear out the corner on U-Haul. Poison Cloud falls. HLs to open things up, but still. Oh my god, dude. They just can't win a fight. No. They're just getting outgunned in all these heads up duels. Including that one. Hunter's Fury coming up unfruitful. Recon Bolt will come in, but they're trying to retake two versus five. Good luck, especially against two alts. Well, Mummy will try to significantly hold on to heaven. Crashies has to clear out the link, and oh my goodness, it's just there's not a gunfight loss for Sentinels, including the final tens cleans things up and flawlessly done. Sentinels win the series 2-0, and a date with 100 thieves. We'll break it down when we come back.